KYT, this is your girl Monica, aka The Return Queen, and I am coming at you this evening with a tag video. Yes, I was tagged by Texas Cutie 75, and this is called the Never Ever Tag. Okay, let's go ahead and get started. I, th I think it's like 10 things that you have never ever done or you will never ever do. My 10 things will be 10 things that I've never ever done. So to start the list, I have never ever had a jerry curl. Nope. <laughs> I have never ever been one of those people who needed to spray curl activator, uh, wear the plastic bag, none of that kind of stuff. Not even in my teenage years when I saw all of my friends going through the jerry curl phase. I have never ever had a jerry curl. Okay, I have never ever been anywhere on a train. I've been on a plane, a bus, car, all those kind of things, but I have never ever been anywhere on a train. Um, I've never ever broken a limb. I haven't had my arm broken, finger, leg, toe, all of those kind of things. I have never ever broken a limb. I mean, you know how when you're in school and the kids come to school with the cast and everybody's able to sign it? For some re weird reason, I wanted to have a cast for some reason. But, thank God, I have never ever broken a limb. I've never ever been on a cruise. I am trying to plan one for my 15th anniversary next year, which will be a first, and I'm super duper excited about that because I've never ever been on a cruise. I have never ever eaten an oyster, and nor do I plan on eating an oyster. I would probably puke at the taste of the slime just, just thinking about it. Uh-uh, so... For those of you who like oysters, more power to you. I hear it's an aphrodisiac. Is that the term for it? When you... Maybe. Who knows. But anyway, yeah, so I've never eaten an oyster. And although I'm from Louisiana, I have never, ever been to the Bayou Classic game. I know. <laughs> Festivities go there yes but never been to the game so that's another never ever I've never ever quit a job now I've left jobs you know with the notice I'm relocating um, or something like that but I have never ever just said you know what I just can't take it no more I quit so I've never ever quit a job um, I have never ever given birth naturally and when I say naturally I don't mean like um with no epidural or anything like that I have three babies and they were all born cesareans so I don't know what it feels like to push and all of that stuff I mean at some point I kind of felt like oh I missed out a little bit I always wanted the stuff you see on TV where the contractions are a certain amount of time apart and you know you're racing out the door and trying to get to the um, hospital in time and push push none of that so I always had scheduled cesarean so um let's see I've never ever been divorced yay to me I've only been married once so yeah and we're going on 15 years very happily married so yeah and I'm hoping to not ever have that one as a thing that I go through so I don't plan on going anywhere so I hope he doesn't either um I've never ever been to jail but I guess if he tried to divorce me then that never ever been to jail would change so hmm I should have said them two last huh I don't know. So I never ever been divorced and I never ever been to jail. We're gonna keep it that way. Alright, let's see. And I think I'm down to my last one. I have never ever gone longer than forty eight hours without talking to my mom. I'm a mama's girl. We used to talk every day, y'all. Now I kinda try to 
and this is multiple times throughout the day just whenever I feel like hey what y'all doing we don't really even talk about nothing half the time she like well look girl I'm gonna let you go and I'll be like I called you though and she'll be like yeah but you ain't talking I don't know something I guess it's about just holding the phone <laughs> I think it's I think it's I think it's I get joy of just holding the phone and knowing she okay on the other end of the line or whatever the case may be. But yeah, so I'm a mama's girl and I talk to my mama all the time about everything. So those were my bro boring 10 never evers. Um, yeah, so that is it for me, you guys. Thank you so much for tagging me. Um, Texas Cutie 75. I think um, I'll tag anybody who's watching who wants to do it. Uh, post a video or something right, today, you guys. Remember, like I always say, if they can't handle you at your worst, they don't deserve you at your best. Thank you so much for watching. Smooches.